All right, it's the final part. I'll talk for maybe five, six minutes. I'm going to shut this camera off. I got to clean the basement. Clean the basement. Take me a good hour and a half to clean it. An hour and 15 minutes to clean it. It won't take me that long. When I get my 10 bucks, I can go to the store and get my 25 pack of smokes. Take my shower. Yeah, I could easily just do a thing whereby once I sign the stars, they come to my condo. We party it up in my condo and I order like pizza or something like that during the party. But it's better to, 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 to what? To take them to, to, to a restaurant. It's better that way. Take them to a restaurant. Obviously, take them to a restaurant, or I could just order pizza for the actors while they're while they're while they're drunk and all that stuff. Would I rather do that, or would I rather take take them out to Boston Pizza? Because most people don't eat before they party it up. Most people party it up first before they eat. That's the thing. No, I'll just take them to Boston Pizza. Or I might perhaps just take, yeah, I might just what? I might just have them, have, have them what? Have them come to my condo. Have them come to my condo and just what? Have them come to my condo and just uh, party it up and I order pizza for, 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 for the actors. See what happens on two. Have them come to my condo and just pile it up. No, I'll, I'll, I'll take them to Boston Pizza. You got to take the stars to Boston Pizza. It's more professional. But after they eat, they're going to be a bit full. Obviously. But they can still pile it up with you. We'll see what happens. I might perhaps change the, the takeout stuff. Maybe have them just pile it up in my condo. Then order pizza. We order like Domino's pizza or something like that. We can do that while while they're getting drunk around like nine o'clock. We order Domino's pizza. No, I'll take them to Boston Pizza. Then I'll party at my condo. It's better that way. Some Sarah. I'll take them to Boston Pizza. Take this house to Boston Pizza. Give them a good experience. You know, I even took me out to a nice dinner, man. I ate some nice food at Boston. We had some good food up in Canada, man. I. Uh, Avon Georgia, you know, you, you know what, you know, I know Boston, he knows Boston pizza, obviously, yeah, they have good food, I mean, yeah, they have good food, they have good pizza, amazing pizza they have, man, pizza's their signature dish at Boston pizza, they have good food, Sarah. and once they sign that contract, and, and we go to the Boston pizza, they're going to be experienced, like, fame, fans are going to be taking reels and videos, like, Ivan's eating out with the stars, and that's the beginning. Of, yeah, holy shit, we're tre we're now trending with Ivan. They fall on top of the world, obviously. It's an amazing feeling. They're trending with me and VJ and Peter and all them. Peter's like, Ivan, this is an amazing feeling. I'm I fall on top of the world. I'm trending like every day. When Peter hangs around with Grandma Torn and all them during the weekends, he'll be trending, man. Or Mel, if fans are gonna take pictures of trending. <laughs> they feel on top of the world. It's an amazing feeling. And that's why once the project's over, they're all gonna beg because they felt on top of the world. He, Mel's like, Ivan, can I direct your Matrix movie? I'm like, no, Mel, you're not good for, for the Matrix, man. Peter was like, can I direct your Grace Game? I'm like, no, Peter, you're not good for the Grace Game. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, you know what I'm saying? You're listening like crazy. Yeah, man. You're listening like crazy, man. Yeah. You're going to fall on top of the world. That's why I'm going to totally forget about this Saturday. That's what you guys are saying. I'm totally going to forget about the Saturday's channel. VJ will forget about her, her old life too. Yeah, Ivan, uh, VJ, did you, did, uh, VJ, do you miss Hollywood? Like, Ivan, are you kidding me? I'm having a blast. I see you now. Uh, Ho Ivan, Hollywood's not what you think it is. It's dirty as fuck over there. Yeah. Are you kidding me? I'm out of Hollywood. I got my freedom. I'm building with you. I'm going to start with you. I'm happy. I'm with you. I see the light. VJ is now happy. You're going to see VJ have a smile on her face. She sees the light. She doesn't see how anymore because she's crazy all the seasons are. Sinsara? Yeah, I know it said, yeah. Sinsara? Let me 
be playing on top of the world. Moving on top of the world, obviously. And that's why they're all going to beg after the journey's over. Uh, the 10 months of filming goes by. There you go, Ivan, it's done. I'm like, yeah, guys, it's done. Like, Holy shit, that went by fast. Oh, it's done, Ivan. I'm like, yeah, guys, it's done. Oh, man, they got their check. Yeah, you got your check. You work your ass off for me. Thank you, you know what I'm saying? Oh, man, my guy, it's not over yet. We still have post production. Post production will take a year, a year, over a year to do. You guys will be experiencing the fame with the fans. Or I might go on that world tour. I don't know. I highly doubt it. Chances are the world tour will not happen because of why behind the scenes. But you're going to be experiencing fame with all the fans around the world. For a year plus. You have the buzz of the game. You have the buzz of the documentary. You guys will enjoy that. And then once the post-production is done. And we sent Amazon the file for them to burn out the portfolio disc. A couple weeks later. We host a red carpet event. I fly you guys to Switzerland. You host a red carpet event. At the, at the hotel. And we do the two day party. And the journey of fishing ends after that obviously. That's when they're really going to beg. The hotel party is when they're really going to beg. Because they know the, the journey now officially ended. They know uh, Ivan and Vijay are moving on to their careers. We're moving on to ours. Yes. Oh man, even though I'm gonna get, even though I got offers, because during post production, the actors are gonna get offers in Hollywood from the from uh, the, the Hollywood companies gonna be calling their agents. Hey, you want to do this movie? They're gonna accept roles, obviously, but like like they, they know what they know they know what. But guys, you can take once production's done. Obviously, once production's done, obviously, you're more than welcome to accept roles in Hollywood, obviously. Except to do a movie and also. But make sure it does not interfere with the red carpet event. The day of the red carpet event. Okay, I, okay, I mean, yeah, if you, if you have to work on it, you have to tell your guys, look, 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 man. The red carpet event and all is a priority over, over, over any project you do. You know what I'm saying? Unless you don't want to be featured in red carpet, let me know. But you don't want to miss this event, guys. This is, you guys will be featured in red carpet with me. The two day the, the goodbye two day party. You don't want to miss this miss this party. Yeah, I, I don't want to miss this party. Yeah, make sure you let your boss know in Hollywood that hey, I can I can still I can film during during post production and all this stuff. The actors already did, did their work. They can film. They can accept roles in Hollywood, which they will get offers in Hollywood, obviously. But make sure it does not interfere with the red carpet event day, guys. So I'm saying, oh, I mean, just, yeah, tell your agent that. Let the agents know. Let your boss know, yeah, I can film the movie, but like the day of the red carpet, when I have to take that day off, I have to go to Switzerland, live Switzerland to go do the party with uh, my, 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 my goodbye party for my Zayn's movie and my red carpet. Yeah, I, we, yeah, it's okay, guys. We don't mind you. We don't mind you what being away for two days. The studios won't mind. Yeah, we don't mind, Ivan. We, you, 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 can, you, can, you, can, you, can, you can grab the actors for two days, have them enjoy the goodbye party with, with you for your movie, then they can come back and work on the movie. Yeah, it's only a two day delay. It's not that bad, obviously. Make sure it does not conflict, guys. As you don't want to miss this event. This is this is a goodbye party. And you're going to be featured in the red. There's nothing worse than, I don't know, I do the red carpet. And John Maega's not there. Avon is not there. It looks very unprofessional. Guys, please, I want you here. And the, the, the actors are not going to want to miss the event. No, I, no guys, seriously, I, I don't want to miss this event. This is important to me, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm, I, I, I'm a part of the Zane's family. I don't want to miss this red carpet event. I want to be... Featured with Ivan on the red carpet. It's fucking cool being featured with, with Ivan on the red carpet. And be, they want to be part of that two-day party, man. That luxury party. That's why, guys, do not miss this event. Is there? Is there? Even for the crewmen. The crewmen are going to get offered. The Lord of crewmen are going to get offers in Hollywood, too. Guys, make sure you, you make it to this event. You don't want to miss this event, man. This is for all you guys. For the entire cast and crew. I could make a full video here, guys. I might as well make a full video. Who's there? Yeah. Please, guys, do not make sure. Yeah. Obviously. And what? Yeah. Same goes for Peter Amell. Peter will guarantee get offers in, uh, in, 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 in Hollywood. Once, uh, once, uh, he's done filming my movie, he's gonna get offers. Mike, Peter, um, you can't, for you, Peter, you can't, for you, Peter Mel, you can't sign on with any, with any projects until the movie's officially done. 
All right, but that's fine. I don't even want to work on Hollywood anyways. Yeah, Peter. I need you I need you here with, with, the, with the special effects team doing your pulse action work. You can't be accepting offers in Hollywood. Like, look, man, you can accept offers in Hollywood, but you can't work during post production. You, ha I want you focused on my movie. If, if, if you get offers in Hollywood, just tell them no. Right now, I can't do. I can't accept offers right now in Hollywood. I'm working on Ivan's. I'm working on my movie, on my Zayn's movie that I directed. I need to focus. I need. Uh, yeah. Tell Mel that too. Mel, you can't accept offers in Hollywood until the the project is done. Once the red carpet event. Once post-production's done, you can now accept offers in Hollywood. While during post-production, I need you focused. I need you watching production with, with, the, with, the, with the visual effects team for like a good year and like two, two three months. So I'm saying, so Peter will, agents will get a lot of offers, but the agent will tell him, yeah, sorry guys, Peter's busy working on his movie, on his Zanus movie. He can't accept any offers. He's, 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 he's under contract. Whereas the actors, can, the actors are exclusive for the four years of Zanus. So once production's done... So while production happens, the actors can't be working in Hollywood. They have to be only work for my movie, obviously. It's an exclusive contract. But after production's done, during post-production, the actors can now accept roles and offers in Hollywood. Magazine contracts, um, you know what I'm saying? Um, roles in Hollywood, they can accept all those stuff. So I'm saying, But during the four years, the actors can't sign on for anything. It's exclusive. Unless they're already they're already signed on for a project, you have to find a way to make it work, obviously, for their schedule, obviously. But if they're not signed on for any projects, if if none of those actors are signed on for any projects, it's it's exclusive. Only work for my company. The only thing you guys can do, if you guys want to, if you get invited to do interviews or Hollywood events or magazine or commercials, you can do that in Hollywood to make good money on the side for yourself. You can do that. Um, but but you can't be signing on for movies and all that kind of stuff. I need you to focus on on Zanus. I'm paying you enough money. I, I need you to focus on Zayn's guys. Screw Hollywood. Focus on Zayn's, I'm sorry. Because guaranteed once production's done, John Baega, Avon, Jose, Ariana Grande, Daniel Manette, Dijima Hansu, Andy Serkis, Angie Bassett, they're all going to get a lot of offers in Hollywood. Hey, you want to do this movie, but Hollywood's cheaper right company. Yeah, John, we'll pay you $2.5 million for this movie, you know what I'm saying? John's like, I'll do the movie, you know what I'm saying? They're more successful now, obviously, but they're still going to feel like shit. And they'd rather, yeah, even though I'm getting offers in Hollywood, man, Hollywood's not Sky Source. Yeah, they'd rather work for me. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? In other words, they feel the bit used by Ivan and VJ. Ivan and VJ, Ivan and VJ pay us a lot of money. Yes, I pay a lot of money. They do their movie, and they move on to the next fucking movie, and we're all left behind. They feel a bit used, obviously. Like, thank you, next, I'm saying. They feel a bit used, obviously, because they want to be work for me. I'd rather work for Ivan than working for. I can't stand Hollywood. Yeah, I said, but I love your careers, man. They're all going to be pretty successful, or very or very successful. So I'm saying, the Ace actors are very successful, but they're only going to get bigger. They're going to be they're going to be bigger name stars. So I just Alba and your best are going to become bigger name stars, but they're very successful, those guys. Are Ace actors, whereas Danielle Manette, Avon, Jojo, and John Baker are going to become Ace actors after Zanus. Ten years go by, they're now worth $25 million, $30 million. They're fucking successful. Or some are really successful, and they're worth $60, $70 million. I don't know how much they'll be worth. But they're all going to have successful careers in Hollywood, or pretty successful careers in Hollywood. Since I am. Okay careers. They do a few big bunch of movies here and there, and they make okay money. And there's some of them who become big name stars, and they become big. I don't know how big they're gonna be, but they're, some are gonna become either some are gonna either be pretty successful or very successful. They become like bigger A-list actors. They're worth like seventy plus million dollars, and the other ones are okay careers. After ten years go by, they're worth maybe twelve million dollars more. They have okay careers. I'm saying, I know Danielle Manette's worth three million now. Ten years go by, she's worth seventeen, eighteen million dollars. She's a small A-list actor, but she had an okay career. She, she she had an okay career, but she's not a super super big star. You know what I'm saying? Or is Andy Serkis, his career skyrockets. He's worth $18 million. Ten years go by, he's now worth $60 million, $50 million. He's a bigger, he's a, he's, he's, he's a, he's a bigger name star. Or $7 million he's worth. So I'm saying that's my point. I don't know how, how big these guys are going to be, but they're going to be, they're going to all be pretty successful, very successful in Hollywood. But if, think about this. They're going to be getting a lot of offers in Hollywood. Some, some offers are a lot of offers in Hollywood by the Hollywood companies. And even then, they're still going to bet because they'd rather work for me. Yeah. Even though I'm gonna work in Hollywood, Hollywood's not skyscrapers, man. I have to do it. I'm a dirty slave. They're not gonna fly me commercial, fly me privately. They're not gonna feed me the this is buffet. 
They're not going to do uh, all these parties in their yacht and all stuff. It's always cheap. They're not going to have limo service every day for me, you know. So they're not going to, they're not, they're not going to give me two thousand dollars with a gas card. They're not going to pay me the kind of money I was willing to pay me. Yeah, they'd rather work for me. My company's brand Hollywood. Since there, yeah, because I just Alba knows if he does a great escape, I can easily pay him his thirteen million dollars base. And give him like eleven point five million dollars in royalties. That's more than what he makes in Hollywood. That's like a twenty four five million dollar deal. He doesn't make twenty five million dollars. Hollywood. He makes like his five six seven eight million in Hollywood. I was cheaper in my company. Yeah, he knows I can pay him more money. From Sarah, yo, know, I have an easy pay my thirteen million dollars for the Grayscape base and give me like eleven point eight million in royalties and two fifty k for the merch. Two thousand you're right there in Hollywood doesn't do that, man. She can run my company, some center. I just Alba is really good for the Great Escape movie, but I'm not gonna sign up for the Great Escape. I even fuck those actors. Just resign them. I'm like, no, I just Alba. It's not fair to the Hollywood actors. I even fuck those actors. Who cares about them? Just resign them. I'm like, no. I'm not gonna have the same actors in my movie. I just. You have to. You have to think about others. It's not just about you. Some center. He'll beg too. Oh, I mean, can I be in that major of Great Escape movie? I'm like, no, I just you're not good for the movie. Knows and Dama Ego begged. You know, I'm saying, oh, Ivan, can I be in your Matrix movie, man? I'm like, no, man, you're not good for the movie. Oh, Ivan, please, man, I don't want to go back to Hollywood, man. Fuck Keanu Reeves, fuck Ben Affleck, Ivan, just fucking resign us. I'm like, no, guys, you're not good for the Great Escape or the Matrix. <laughs> it's not fair to Keanu, it's not fair to Scarlet, it's not fair to what? To Ben, it's not fair to John Krasinski, it's not fair to Brie Larson, it's not fair to Michael B. Jordan. They all want to be saved, too, it's not just about you, you need to give other people an opportunity, man. Especially if I do the matches, the the the, the, the Zane's actors are really gonna be envious. I mean, what the fuck? It's not fair. You're 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 doing a matrix trilogy. You're gonna save those actors for nine, ten years of their life. We want to be saved too. I'm like, I saved you for five years, for half a decade. You experienced that buzzing me for five fucking years. That's good enough. <clears throat> because these actors are used to being saved, being a part of the Zane's family, being a part of that journey. Even during post production, the actors will feel saved because there's the, the Zane's project is not over yet. They're still experiencing the buzz from the fans. Chances are they're going to go on a vacation together. They're going to become friends, obviously. They're going to go on a vacation together. They're experiencing the buzz with the fans. They're still a part of that Zayn's buzz. The movie did not come out yet. They're part of the buzz for the... While post production takes place, the doc team will be... The, 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 the ad will be releasing trailers for the what? The doc, the doc trailers already got released. The world's excited to see the doc. The game trailer got released. The world's excited to see the rabbit walkthrough for the Zayn's game. The actors are part of that buzz for that, yeah. And once the movie's re ready to be released on Amazon, you end it off with the red carpet event at the Virgin Doc Hotel and the and, and, and the two-day party. So for all my movies, I'm going to do a red carpet event in a hotel. Inside and outside the hotel. That way it's unique. My company's very unique, obviously. It's better in Hollywood. The greatest thing I'll rent a hotel in Italy. The majors I'll rent a hotel probably in Australia. I heard it was from Australia or like America. You do the red carpet there, a luxury hotel, you rent it. You do a two-day party, you host the red carpet event there. So that's why that one my company is top notch. You know what I'm doing. Some Sarah. Like these actors are gonna get a lot of offers in Hollywood, Zane's actors. But they still rather work for me. Yeah. You know, I'm gonna be a side attention. I mean we just saw the main show. Yeah, they're gonna feel like shit obviously. But I lost your careers, man. You're welcome, actors. I launched their fucking careers. Especially the B-list actors and rising stars, I launched their careers for my movie. They're all going to be A-list actors after, after Zane's guaranteed. They're legends, man. They're, they're, they're never going to be the same. They're worldwide famous. They're going to guarantee be A-list actors after Zane's. Obviously. Whereas for all my other movies, the actors will either be rising stars or A-list actors. Um, it just depends on how, what, what. If the guy's an A-list actor, he, he's, he's already successful. But if the guy's a B-list actor or rising star... Chances are he will remain a rising star or he'll become an A's actor. But for Zayas, all the actors are going to be A's actors, the, the, the major stars. And the minor ones will be like rising stars because, because it's, 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 a, it's a special story. They're all going to be legends. Fighting Eretz and all those devils, man. These actors are going to be legends, man. And that's why they're the luckiest out of all the chosen actors for my movies. Fuck, man. You're lucky to be in that. All the Hollywood actors and everything. Fuck, you're lucky to be in that movie, man. You're going to be part of that story with Eretz and all those devils. Yes. Zayas actors are lucky, yeah, man. That's why these A's actors are going to experience that success and fame with me and DJ. 
Because you guys are left behind, yeah. But that's why they're going to brag. Haha, I'm saying you're left behind, yeah. I'm going to come to blow out of the water. Anyways, this video is out of I ran a timer. I'm going to upload this video, clean the basement, get my $10, and go to the store, get my most enjoyable video. You guys, I don't know. I'm signing up. Peace.